Jada! Say, have you ever wanted to make an animation like this? <gasps> no? Well, you've come to the right place. Follow me. Okay, the first thing you need to animate... ...is an animation program. This how-to is going to be based on Adobe Flash and or Animate. Whatever version you have should work, but I have Adobe Animate 2019, so we're doing that one. You also need an image of this in software so you can actually make this right through animation. I won't go too deep into this because there's like a million of these. Just make sure what you use can handle and mix rates. Before we start, I should mention I'm not going to talk about where to find buttons in the program. You should be able to select what you need in the window tab at the top. Okay, side quest. Grab or draw anything. Select and press convert symbol. Change type to graphic and press OK. Go to your history. Select convert to symbol on it and press the save steps button. Name and press OK. Press edit and keyboard shortcuts. Search your name and your command. And set the shortcut to what you want. Okay, we're done with that. Let's actually make something now. This is what my workspace looks like. Timelines over the keyframes, layers, and everything you animate go. Pick a colour here, but it's easier to... The library is where all the assets for the animation go. If you import something to the project, you'll find it in there. If you're working with sprites, then when you've imported them all in separately, right-click the library item and press Properties. Now set Compression to Lossless and Turn Smooth enough. Keeping these on will make the animation look a little less this, and more like this. Oof. Everything you touch in the project has properties, symbols, text, etc. You'll find everything from position, size, color effects, looping, and text ah! settings. We'll touch on that layer. This is your toolkit, and this is your new best friend from now on. This is what it looks like when you select something with it. The dot controls the rotation and scale center of it. You've probably watched a video on this before, so I'll cut this short. F5 extends the frame. F6 makes a new frame. Mm. F7 makes a blank keyframe. Oh, no. Classic tweens make things move automatically. Watch it. Find the easing options in the properties menu to spice up your tweens. Do it frame by frame if you're cooler than me. <laughs> this is a VCam. It doesn't come with Adobe Animate. VCam is a camera. Move it with keyframes to move the view. Make sure to keep the size the same as the project size, otherwise it breaks easy. The VCAM I use is by Shuriken255. You can find more info in the description. Press F8 or follow that side quest I did Whoa. at the beginning to make a symbol. Make sure it's set to graphic. Symbols are pretty much animations in a the box. They turn something complicated like this into a much more easier this. With another timeline in the symbol, you'd think it'd be more complicated. But symbols allow you to repeat animations easily, have smoother animations, and add color effects. I use paint.net to make sprites, and whilst there's probably a better way of doing this, I select and copy all of the sprites manually. The swap button works on both bitmaps and symbols. I won't explain it too much, but if you use it, you'll get the hang of it. The sprite resource is an awesome place to get assets. Be sure to credit. Folders exist in the library and the timeline. If you're still confused, please check out Yen's tutorials on animation. He goes more in depth than I do, and he can actually read his scripts correctly. Okay, with my knowledge and your expertise, let's see what you made. Hmm. Well, I'd say I'm about a show and tell person. So maybe a live quick animation making could help you on your journey.
As you saw in the example, you use the control tab at the top to test your animation. This creates an SWF file, which you need to export to an actual video file. This is where Swivel comes in. Add the files to Swivel. Now turn automatic bit that's moving off. And finally, export. So aside from medicine, which is an entirely other situation, we did it. Now, with your new animation knowledge, go out and make... Preferably not that.